Hello, Dr. Jero. How are I already did it. Ugh, you dick! We were supposed to do that together! I know, but I couldn't help myself. Whatever. Okay, you know, we want to start the protagonist is here. I know some of you are probably wondering how I spent over 20,000 V-Bucks despite the length of the video. Well, I'm just gonna cut to the chase here. I spent like three weeks without internet because the house had to be redone. Basically, the floors had to be redone due to something happening to the living room. So, yeah, that's pretty much the gist of it. But we're finally back and I can finally get back to uploading. So, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much the gist of it. But nonetheless, I'm gonna be spending 20,000 V Bucks in episode three of the spending spree. Wow, that actually, that actually rhymed. But, um, yeah, you'll probably see when the next, um, installment of the spending spree will be which will be at the end of the video that's where you'll find out when but regardless i hope you all enjoy uh without further ado let episode three of the spending spree get started all right spending spree number three wow that actually fine but anyways we're starting this off with our first purchase and that's going to be the wish set match quest pack that is a bit of a tongue twister and if i remember correctly uh court queen aressa is actually a reskin of the original skin aressa who made her debut in chapter 3 season 2 of the battle pass and speaking of which i'm hoping that they actually make a reskin of lennox rose because i actually missed out on her when she was in chapter 3 season 4 and of course she also has a second edit style which is the summer casual which is a good it is a good style i do like the t-shirt that she has it's pretty much of an anime shirt but i think i prefer her original style more also you have the you can also turn off the cell shading but i like the original cell shading it's a lot better and way better than the gradient styles but nonetheless uh you get the skin along with the back bling and the pickaxe a wrap which is pretty much an anime wrap i don't know kind of gives me the uwu vibes you also get 1500 v bucks in quest so we're gonna add 1500 v bucks to the total and there we go all right so we got season four of fortnite festival and this time we have metallica now i'm gonna be honest i've never heard much of metallica the only song i've heard of them was from uh guitar hero 3 where they had a song one uh, and this was pretty much one of the final songs throughout the campaign. Four skins for 1800 V-Bucks. I think this is actually the best festival pass so far. At least until we get to season seven. But nonetheless, I'm upgrading this shit. Come on, four skins for 1800 V-Bucks. Who the fuck would pass on? Who the fuck would pass out on this? It is literally 2 a.m. in the morning, so I'm going to try and make this clip as quick as I possibly can. But as you can see, this is the Summer Legends pack, and I've been meaning to get in this ever since it just dropped again. I've been meaning to get in this, and the reason why I've been wanting to get this is mainly for this skin. Tropical Punch, Zoe, I think it's just the best design overall out of this pack. I really do like it a lot. Since this is like almost $20, I'm going to add 2,800 V-Bucks to the total. And there we go. All right, so we're at the Lewis Hamilton bundle because my younger cousin, Jaquan, already have one of the skins, but he's missing the rest of the cosmetics and he only has 700 V-Bucks in order to pay. So I'm going to be giving him the rest of the bundle. Okay, so a bit of a heads up here. I'm actually living with my mom for a few weeks until we get the house uh, straightened out. So if you hear any background noise, I apologize. But if you don't, then we're good. We're Gucci. But as you can see in the item shop, we have Pirates of the Caribbean. Now, I'm going to be honest. I've never watched a single movie in my life, but I have heard of like I have heard of Jack uh, Sparrow as well as Davy Jones and some of the other characters. The bundle itself is 3400 yet every character, uh, Elizabeth, along with Davy Jones, they're both 1600 which is fair considering that they also have the pickaxe uh, bundled in. But what's, also, but what's really weird is Captain Barbosa, he has no back bling. Instead, he has a pickaxe. So that's a bit odd. I did not think that it, it, we would have one skin that doesn't have a pickaxe. Well, not a pickaxe, but a back bling. And of course, there's also the emote not copyrighted 
this is a really cool bundle and for 3400 v bucks you get three skins three pickaxes two back blings, and an emo you know i think this is the price this is pretty fair considering that we do get a lot in this bundle uh kind of weird that it's like on the same pricing as metallica but nonetheless it's pretty it's pretty fair i kind of wish we would get the pickaxes separately i think that's my one main issue is that the pickaxes are not separately but nonetheless i am going to be getting one of the skins and i think out of these three i'm feeling elizabeth swan a bit more so i'm gonna get her the pirates of the caribbean event just started and we got the event pass which is called curse sales i will say while not as spectacular as the tmnt pass at least it's better than the avatar pass and i will say the event uh, I can see it being better than the avatar event as well, but that's just me though. Regardless, I think we're just gonna upgrade this pass, you know, mainly because I want Jack Skellington. And also, the items, they're not bad. N not as spectacular as TMNT's, but they're better than the avatars, I will say. So let's, we're gonna upgrade this. Yeah, Ariana Grande, which I'm am missing the OG Ariana. I'm hoping that she actually comes back. Oh my god! She's here. She's back. She's finally back after 465 days. Oh my god, yes! Finally! Finally, Ariana Grande, the OG skin is back! Woo! Oh my god, you, you guys have no idea how much I wanted this to come back. And yes, as you can see, I own this skin, and it's all thanks to Phoenix. Yes, because he's gifted me the skin. Thank you so much, Phoenix. I really appreciate it. But that's not the only thing we have to add. As you can see, we are at the downhill demon bundle, and the reason why is because I actually gifted Phoenix the tornado spin emote and then of course i gifted him the sticky situation emote which both of them were each 200 v bucks a pop so this was a steal for him so yeah i hope you enjoyed these gifts phoenix and also thank you so much for ariana grande i really appreciate it a lot man all right so i'm in a bit of a hurry so i'm gonna make this clip as quick as i can firstly we're gonna get this cosmic flare wrap which is a really really awesome animated wrap Okay, what the hell? Hello? Game? Game? Hello? Accept my purchase? Okay, there we go, finally. And also down here is the new emote mine, which I saw like a few days ago. And yes, this is copyrighted. I really like this emote a lot. I saw it on Twitter, so we're gonna get that as well. Well, this is the last clip of the spending spree. I gotta be completely honest, this has to be one disaster of a spending spree because I just wasn't able to keep up with the stuff that was coming out and that was mainly because the fact that I had no internet for the past two weeks. Anyway, before we actually end this off, there's some things I wanted to get out of the way and by that, I mean I mean some stuff we gotta add. So first I gotta add this skin here, 2000 V-Bucks to Fortnite crew as usual. Then I also got the Lethal Company bundle, which was actually gifted to me by Phoenix. So thank you once again, Phoenix, for that. I really appreciate it. Then I also gifted my younger cousin, Jay Kwan, the Satori Gojo skin from Jujutsu Kaisen. And then, of course, I also bought myself the Butter Jam Track by BTS. And this was actually one of the jam tracks I've been meaning to get because, well, I'm a big fan of BTS and I really enjoyed a whole lot of their music. So let's see what we got into the shop. <laughs> Oh my god, I, I, I was not expecting them to actually drop this so early, but we got Android 17 and 18 in the item shop, and I am all for it, 100%. I am, was really looking forward to it ever since I saw this, but what also really caught my eye is the fact that we also got trunks as well. 
I was not expecting him to come alongside the androids, but I am 100% all for it. So yeah, thank you, Epic. This is actually, wow, I'm just, wow. So normally the bundle itself is 2300 V-Bucks because each skin costs 1500, but uh, as you can see, one of, the, one of the skins was actually gifted to me by Juju. So the link to the channel will be in the description below. So I really appreciate it a lot. But the reason, but as you can see, we're uh, gonna be getting the rest of this stuff, of course, because I am a massive Dragon Ball fan. And why would I, why would I skip out on this? The only thing that I that really disappoint me a bit is the fact that they don't have edit styles. I would have appreciated it if they actually gave 17 his Park Ranger edit style. And I also would have appreciated if they gave 18 some edit styles as well. I mean, she had many different outfits, so it would have made sense to give them more outfits. But nonetheless, I really do appreciate the fact that we can actually buy these skins separately and not what they were doing with some of these collabs. So we're gonna get the rest of this bundle, obviously. And of course, I am also getting Trunks because, you know, he's one of my favorite characters. I really enjoy the amount of development he has gone through. And I'm so glad they went with his original style instead of his Dragon Ball Super style. And plus, look at that. He can also have his uh, transformation emote as well as his edit style, which is the Super Saiyan transformation. Not only that, but he also has his sword, which is the back bling and pickaxe combined together. The price itself, 2000 a bit hefty, but it kind of makes sense considering that, from my eyes, I think he could be a legendary skin. Oh, hell no! <laughs> so, we're gonna get him as well. Considering this the final purchase of the spinning spree. That is gonna be it for episode 3 of the spinning spree. Uh, this has to be my the most disappointing episode I have to do, but... At the very least, the purchases and the gifts themselves really made up for it, so I really appreciate that. I also appreciate you all for the amount of support you've all been giving throughout the channel, as well as the Fortnite videos, because they've been really growing so very rapidly. So, yeah, I really appreciate it a lot. Thank you all for watching, and if you enjoy, be sure to uh, hit the like button as well as subscribe. You can expect the next episode to be during ch Chapter 5 Season 4. So yeah, that will be my next, that will be when my next spin is free. But until then, this is Starter Protagonist signing out. As always, Goki Genyo and have a star testing day, everyone. If you enjoyed today's video, then be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and turn those notifications on to join the Star Nation. Also, be sure to follow my Twitter, and while you're at it, check out my previous video. Now.